Hi everyone and welcome to this video and if you're new, welcome to my channel. Today you're here to see me review and swatch the new Too Faced Chocolate Gold palette. Now this is the packaging that palette comes in. It looks so beautiful, this gold shade and brown. I love, love this packaging. And this is how it looks. Yeah, so this palette contains 14 eyeshadows gold and cocoa powder infused eyeshadow palette that smells as good as it looks have a major metallic moment with foiled shadows that are, cre that are created with real gold for epic high shine finish that paired with rich seductive mattes for coffee to cocktails wear wait real gold that that sounds weird uh, all shadows Features soft, velvety texture and with full coverage payoff. The entire palette is infused with skin-loving cocoa powder for a decent chocolate scent. And I have to say, it smells exactly at the first chocolate bar palette that I did. It smells wonderful. <clears throat> so this is the palette. And I know it's not clean because I've been using this the whole week. And I did that because I wanted to see if I really like the palette and what things about the palette that I like and don't like. That's why I used it the whole week, every day. So this is how it looks, it's kind of heavy. I love this packaging, it looks beautiful. This is how it looks on the, this side. And it says the same uh, takes like as in this packaging. And let's open uh, this one. And this is how it looks. It comes with a big, big mirror. And this is the palette. I have to say, this is the most beautiful palette that I've ever seen. It looks so beautiful. I did watch many videos of the, uh, and swatches of this palette. And this palette looks more beautiful in real life than in every any video that I watched. Because these shades are stunning. And I have to say, it smells chocolate. I love this scent. This is the colors. We have four mattes and the rest are shimmery or metallics. I have to say they are, these mattes are wonderful. They have some transition shade. This black, it's very, very pigmented. And this is cocoa truffle, also a very nice shade that you can have in your, uh, as a transition shade in your crease or you can uh, build it up so you get this more intense chocolate shade it's wonderful i love it and i want today to create a makeup look i have really no idea what makeup look i'm going to create but i think i want to use this gold shade up here because i've been using almost every shade in here but i didn't use this green and this gold and this pink so i think i'm going to use some of those uh, maybe those shades but if you want to see me creating a makeup look, please keep on watching. I mean, I love this mirror in this palette. It's big, it's beautiful, and I can see everything in here. I did use this to go to work. Or you can make these shades a little bit soft. Depends how hard uh, you go and how much you build these shades on your eyes. But I love this palette. I, yeah, I said it in the beginning of the video. I love it. Okay, so let's start with this makeup look. I already primed my eyes and I primed it with this NYX uh, Prove It Waterproof Eyeshadow Primer uh, that I'm trying out. And I did set it with this light shade here in this palette. And I already did the rest of my makeup because I want to show you if there is any fallout of the, these shades. I am going to take all my makeup after this video because it's very late here in Sweden. It's almost 10 o'clock at night, so I'm not going to have it for long on my face. And uh, yeah, let's start. So I'm going to take a, a fluffy brush. This is uh, Zoeva 228 and I'm going to go into this room and I'm going to put this all over my eyelid. I already set my, um, my primer but I want to use this shade as a base and it's very light, so I do like it. It smells chocolate. Then I'm going to take the same brush and go into this 
can't pronounce this name of this shade, but it's this shade here. And I'm going to build that shade. They are pigmented and very easy to blend. I'm going to build up the shade in my crease. Look how beautiful and so easy to blend. And with this brush, it's very easy to blend this shade into the crease. And I'm going to take this a little bit higher than I usually do when I put my shades in my crease. Let's switch the brush. Now I'm going to take my favorite crease brush and this is Beach Cosmetics number six. And I'm going to take that shade again, this one, and just build it up. But now I'm going to concentrate into my crease. Not going to build it up as high as I did before. Back and forward, just blend. Okay, I'm going to take the same brush and I'm going to do Cocoa Truffle. That's this, that, that's this shade here, dark brown. And concentrate here and blend it into the crease a little bit. Ooh, I'm liking this right now. I'm going to switch the brush and I'm going to take actually this brush here, it's Zoeva 231, and I'm going to take a little bit of this bra black shade, can't pronounce the name of it. Um, look how pigmented this is. And I just tap my brush soft into the shade. really like how this look. Now I'm going to take and take this chocolate gold eyeshadow and place it on my eyelid. Ooh, look how pretty this is. Then I'm going to take the, this brush again, number six from BH Cosmetics, and just blend a little bit into the, a uh, little bit my crease. I'm so tired, I forgot how to speak. Okay, that's, that's beautiful. And I'm actually going to take this brush again without any eyeshadow. This is 231 that we use for that dark brown and black shade. And just try to blend a little bit here, so we don't have any harsh lines. Now I'm actually going to take my finger here and go into this rich girl. Ooh. That's pretty. Okay, I'm going to take another brush. This is just on like a little bit the brush and I'm going to take this shade here right now and work that a little bit into my lower lash line. I'm going to take this brow, this, this is a brow line, brow line 322 from Zoeva. I'm actually going to use it under my lower lash line because I like to pack my eyeshadows with this brush and I'm going to take this new money, this pink shade. I really like this shade, haven't used that one. So I'm going to take that on this brush and place it on under my lower lash line, very close to my lash line. I'm go actually going to try to wet this brush and uh, place that shade new money again and see if I can make it more intense. Not that I need to, but using this. I like using that one under my eyes, but 
that's what I have here. Oh yes, beautiful, beautiful. And I really want to go into with this brush again. And uh, now let wait. I'm going to take this kind of brush, a smaller flat, br smaller brush, and I'm going to take this cocoa shade here, this dark brown, and uh, kind of blend it a little bit under this, under my lower lash line, but under this pink shade. Going to take a little bit with the this black shade with this brush and just place it here. So I'm going to clean this brush and I'm going to go into this rolling in the, this shade here and place that under my brow just to highlight a little bit. I'm going to take this gray. Um, Perfect Contour Kayal Waterproof Isadora. This is deep gray and place that in my lower lash line, on my lower lash line. Nope. Place that, pla place that here. So I'm going to do eyeliner and my lashes off camera and I'll be right back. So now I have a thin eyeliner on and I used this, oh, this is the Steve Laurent Precision Tip Liner in black and also my Demi Wisp, Whispers um, eyelashes. And I'm going to use uh, this lip gloss. This is uh, Moonchild, that collaboration with uh, Colourpop and Caitlin Light. This is the final look. I love how this eye look turned out. I love it. I think it's beautiful. I think it's it's fresh. It's it looks uh, kind of um, spring. It looks like spring. It says spring. <laughs> I really really like it. The shade eyeshadows are very easy to blend. Very easy to build up. Also, I like that kind of eyeshadows that are pigmented but very soft and very buildable so I can really really like this makeup look now let's swatch this palette It's kind of first time uh, that I swatch my eyeshadows like this. So protect, protect myself from something. Uh, but yeah, I really, really like this make uh, this palette. And can't make look, of course. But I really like this palette. It smells beautiful. It smells nice. Very easy to blend. Very pigmented. Very easy to build up. I kind of sound like a broken track, but I can't say enough. Is there anything that I don't like? No. I don't know, guys. I maybe I will I would maybe switch some of the some of these shades. I don't know. I will maybe take out this one or this one and replace it with uh, another bright color, maybe like uh, blue. I love all of them. I mean, I can create so many beautiful makeup looks with this palette and I think it's a wonderful palette. I think it's a, it's worth the money. I love it. The packaging is perfect. Very easy to travel with. Um, I don't know if you can hear it. Clothes is very nice. 
And if you're a beginner and don't know what makeup you look you can create, maybe you can follow this this video if you like this makeup look, but also you get like a, what is how to glamour guide. You get a guide in this palette also and it shows you how you can create a makeup look. This is kind of similar to this one that I have, but not really. Um, it says exactly how to make a, create a makeup look. And then you have this one here also. So if you're not sure how to use these shades, you can maybe use this guide and try to create something. Or you can watch my video, try to create this one. I'm very happy. I really like how this makeup look turns out. Please give a thumbs up if you like this video and let me know if you want me to make another makeup look with this palette and if so, what shade do you want me to use or try to create... Um, what shades do you want me to use and see how they work on the eyes. But yeah, that was everything guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you like this video and want to see more of my videos. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. And thank you so much for watching again and see you in my next video. Bye!